Hello everybody and welcome back to another video on the Ty Gibbs Fan 2021 channel. Today for our Truck Series Diecast review, we're going to be reviewing Kyle Busch's 2019. I do not know if this is Las Vegas or Atlanta win, but it is one of the two. And it's going to be a fun review and let's get into it. All right, so we'll start off with the left side. This still has a lot of contingencies on it, so I don't know. This is the first, yes, I think this is the first Toyota diecast we will be reviewing on this channel. <coughs> Sorry about that, you guys. I had to sneeze. Um, okay, we'll just get started with the left side. And seriously with this focusing problem. This camera doesn't know what the word focus means, but looks like it says mechanics wear, K and N, Lincoln Welders, um, RCS, Simpson, Duralast, and then the Gander Outdoor Truck Series logo and Mobile One and Holly Farms. And then we have this um uh, Nice little red and white swooshy design right there. It's not really a swoosh, but it is a pretty cool design, I think. Um, this is the paint scheme that they've had for a while, so. <laughs> uh, there's the 51. I love the KBM 51 font. I don't know why I like it so much. I just do. <laughs> um, and we go down here. There is a lot of small logos. No, it's not. It just looked like uh, Interstate Batteries. Mobile One, Lincoln Welders, and TRD are down here. Um, we look at this side. If I can even remotely tell, it says Toyota, something I can't read, Rowdy, and KBM right over here. Wow, the focus problem is really bad today. Wow. Wow. It says Rowdy up on the name rail, 51 on the roof. I know I don't usually say it that usually that early, but I decided to today. Decided to change it up. Then we go to the left side, Beechcraft. Um, I like the lining off on the patterns back here. I think that looks pretty nice. Um, then we got the Goodyear Eagles right here. Boom, boom. <laughs> Exalta, Sirius XM, um, something I don't know what it is, and your ethanol ring. Go over the right side, which is the same as the left, and now we will look at the front, and oh my, look at this big paint chip right there, whoo wee Lionel at its finest right there, I guess, right? Wow, that's bad. Whew. I mean, it could have been me because I have had this paint scheme and this truck for about two years now. So, not two years, but a year and a half. But, um, no focus on this camera still. It doesn't even focus at all. If the word focus had anything to do with this camera, it wouldn't be a word. <laughs> Moog, Edelbrock, Sunoco, down there. There's a 51 right here. Got the Toyota Grill, massive paint chip. Tundra. Right side of the hood. I'm at left side of the nose. Same as the right. Boom, that's, uh, that's right. Because I know people get confused on that sometimes. But, um, we go to 51. I'm not saying that people get confused on left side and right side, but left side when you're looking this way, because this is left side instead of right. 51 up here, and we got Toyota, Beechcraft, now we go to the front, Cessna, Toyota, I'm at the back, not the front, Cessna, Toyota, taillights, and Tundra, and the 51. Then it says Toyota down at the bottom. Um, yeah, 
That's going to do it for this NASCAR diecast review on Kyle Busch's 2020, 2019 actually, Cessna Beechcraft Toyota Tundra. Have a good day and see you next time.